This video dynamically illustrates the attributes as shown on the Optimax Manufacturing Tolerances chart. Features are exaggerated for illustrative purposes. We begin by looking at the essential mechanical attributes, outside diameter, sag, center thickness, and overall height. Next, we introduce centering error, as seen as edge thickness difference. This represents misalignment between the optical and mechanical axes of a lens. Moving in on a lens surface, we begin to look at the range spherical radii have. Tolerancing radius can be done as linear tolerancing of radius, with the ranges joined at the center, or as power with ranges over the diameter. Next, we look at surface irregularity and see how the deviation from perfectly spherical can be characterized using a peak-to-valley specification. Moving on to view a section of the lens surface, we can see what physical characteristic is represented in a slope error specification comprised of integrating length and slope angle. Next, we look at the effect the chosen integration length will have on slope angle. Angle typically increases as a function of decreasing integrating length. Now, taking a look at the texture of the lens surface, we can see the origins of a surface roughness specification. In this case, we're showing an RMS measurement. Rewinding, we see how it all comes together. Specifications, whether micro or macro, define the lens. For more detailed information, please see the Optimax website.